Hey guys, got off to an exceedingly late start. It's almost one o'clock. And uh, the objective today is to do a little cycle tour of Seoul. See a couple of places, very touristy. First stop is a place called City Hall. Let's go. Okay, so I'm at City Hall, and uh, there's a weird protest out in front. I don't know what it's about. I think it's about, um, it's probably about America, probably about North Korea. I'm gonna see if anybody speaks English, they can tell me. She is the old president, right? Yes. Before? Yeah. You support her. You support her? Yeah. Why do you have a picture of Rex Tillerson? He is American uh, uh, he's, Secretary of State. He does support to our democracy, uh, 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 I think. Okay, yeah. okay. So how long have you been here? Four months. Four months? Yeah. Wow. Do you live here day and night? Or you go home? Every tent, I stay, sleep. And S stay here? Every dark one, the dark tents? Yeah. Okay. Well, <laughs> it's nice to meet you. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Nothing wrong with peaceful protests. I can't quite figure out. It sounds like they support the ousted president. There's a picture of Rex Tillerson. There's some military images. Nothing wrong with speaking loudly as long as it's peaceful. What is the story with this area here? Is this public? Anybody can protest here if they want? Yeah, it's possible to anyone come here and protest. It's our right. It's okay. So some of them are supporting the old president and some of them are... I saw a picture of Rex Tillerson in America. There was a lot going on there. Exactly. Yeah. And usually the young generation, we cannot accept the uh, old president. Yeah. But the old, the elders, they yeah. like, whatever they did the wrong things, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. matter. So she is our president and they think that the reason why Korea lives good life now uh. is because her, her, her. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Are you are you worried at all about like what's going on in North Korea right now and America? Is that like, is there a lot of people around here that are a little bit like worried about that, or is that not really something you're thinking about? Uh, well, I think uh, it became really big issue at this moment, and of course I'm really worried about it. But the thing is, most Koreans, including me. We don't feel the war things in our skin. Yeah. Every day there's a news about North Korea and do you know the thoughts? Oh, thought thad, thad, yeah, yeah, thought? yeah, yeah. It's, the it's, missiles, missile defense system. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we worry about that very much. If, if, are you from USA? Yeah. Well, in America right now, everybody is worried that war, war is going to start. And they think that, they think that Seoul is in danger to, to, tonight, right now. <laughs> My family back home, they're like, you're crazy to go to Korea. They're gonna start bombing right now, like North Korea. Uh, I felt the same thing when I was in Canada. Yeah. <laughs> because uh, about the times that I need to go back to Korea, yeah. there's all the news about the South Korea and North Korea and the shooting and everything. So I felt really frustrated and yeah. very scared. Yeah. But when I came here, everything is so peaceful. Everything is the same. You think the news makes things a little bit too crazy? That's true. Yeah, I think so. Not everyone agreed with the thought program. And yeah. I don't think elders maybe the older generation they don't totally know what the program is and yeah. that stuff and we don't have the president at this moment and i don't know why is that agreement it could be made yeah like uh, protesting is quite a uh, pastime here. Not one block, I, I realize that I'm in City Hall. This is where voices get heard, but it seems like everywhere, every street corner, there's there's one more uh, no fad or we want the president or we need a new president or there's a lot of political energy going on. But there's also people dressed up and doing fun things as well.
Korea is interesting. Uh, there's a lot of similarities to China, but it's, it's a lot cleaner, a lot more organized, I could tell. Their, people's outfits are a little bit crisper. I don't know if that makes a sense. It looks like everybody's stuff looks like it's been ironed. It's interesting though, I don't get quite the reaction that I do in China to the trike. Today is meant to be a very superficial look at this specific downtown area of Seoul. I'm not really going too far into places. I'm not gonna buy tickets. I just kinda wanna get a lay of the land before I uh, head out. I'm gonna head down to Port Busan. It's important to know exactly how I'm gonna get by, but there is a road that pretty much goes all the way to Busan that uh, is designed for, for cycling, so that should be nice. I am quite literally just going with the flow. I see a corner, I turn on it. I'm just going from sidewalk to sidewalk. Interesting places, but I'm, I'm really just roaming aimlessly. It's, it's good to like kind of get the feel for the, for the city. But yeah, it's, it's got no specific direction at all. Street vendors going off to work. There's one thing I've got my eye out for. An outdoor place I can have a beer. I passed a couple on the busy street way back, but I just, I didn't stop then. Hello. But I, I, I would definitely stop now if I saw, if I saw a place and it jumped out in front of me. Jump out in front of me, beer place. I do think that my mission to find a vlogger in Korea, or at least in Seoul, is coming out to be a resounding failure. I really want to Look, bro, my vlogger one-on-one -on -one series. Nobody's been biting on the little bit of energy I put into it so far, so I don't know. I feel bummed out on that. I don't think you could really go a wrong way inside Seoul. Every turn I find a cool street with a bunch of really interesting things to look at. There's a bunch of flags above me, and the wind blows and they all flap. And they make a really interesting sound. <laughs> Still no beer place though, but I, I have a feeling it's not far away. Well, I found a place for a drink. Not really on the street. It's kind of like a TGI Fridays. It'll probably be really nice later, but right now it's kind of empty. <laughs> but I can keep an eye on the trike, so that's good. I'd say the one thing that's kind of been disappointing is just, I mean, the bike areas, the bike paths here are really awesome. You stay on the bike paths, you'll have no problem. But you go off of them and you go into the city and there's a lot of traffic and there's a lot of places where you, sh you can't go and you don't really know you can't go there until you get it there and then you've got to backtrack. Uh, I'm gonna post my my ride today and you'll see it just kind of it just zigzags. I, I did kind of meaningfully go aimless if that can make any sense like just roam around but I did find frustrating dead ends and frustrating turnarounds like for example right now I want to get to the water and it just seems really difficult. I think I should have left the trike at the hotel and done today on a, on a foot and backpack method. I think it would have been better for me. You can only look at things in hindsight, right? But I have a beer and that's one very good thing. Here, here are my, my buddies, Felicia and Leon, right? Leon. Leon. 
they uh, they've been. How long have you been following my videos? Uh, it's about a month. Six months. Six months. Six yeah. months. Yeah. yeah. They. I saw. I looked in the rearview mirror and I saw her face. And she goes, Jayo. Uh, you may be a little short, actually. Oh uh, yeah. It's it's, it's awesome. <laughs> and you just get this thing from Chenat here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hi. Uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> Let's go. What kind of food do you prefer? Anything's fine. Wow. Already out. They're quick. What is this type of uh, food? The name is Jukpal and Gusta. No dipping into the, into the soup. <laughs> So the rice cake in China is called Nian Gao. Nian is year, Gao is tall. So one year taller. Like like that's why it's, it's very similar, very similar. So here, Nian Gao. Nian Gao is like compressed rice cakes in, in China, but here it's called To. And they said it's a very similar meaning. That uh, the, the next year you're, you're gonna be greater. You're gonna get more yeah, healthy, more everything. <laughs> Are your fingers okay? No. I didn't bite any fingers, did I? <laughs> Look at that! That's so nice. <laughs> Very cool. So who else are you a big fan of? Uh, I'm a big fan of Dayo. And? And uh, Rainy Shanghai. <laughs> it was nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Take it easy. Dayo. Dayo. <laughs> Alright, so now we're headed to a place to get something for my iPhone. They're gonna help me. I need a little dongle. Yeah, that little dongle. I'll, I'll, I gotta buy ten of them because I know I'll lose nine of them. I have a filmmaker. Yeah. <laughs> Holding the camera, cameraman. Yeah, part time job. That's volunteer. volunteer. I love it. Yeah, you just have to go very slow and keep your eyes open. People are coming at you from every direction. Maybe you will be appearing on newspaper tomorrow. <laughs> That was one thing I wanted to do. I wanted, <laughs> no, no, really, really. I wanted to contact cool, some, yeah. some news and media, but I haven't been able to. I think that would be a fun interview. All right, so we have my adapters. I bought two of them because I know I'm going to lose one. But now I have two. But now what are we going to do? Now we have some kind of beer or Korean ice cream. So this is the first floor, and the first floor is the icy stuff, and then the second floor is the fizzy stuff, the frothy stuff, the beer. Yeah, I'm just saying that I'm really happy that they reached out to me. It was really cool. They they heard that I was coming to Korea, and then they con you co first contacted me like a couple of days ago, right? So, <laughs> cool. Are we going up? We're going up? Yeah. Are we, we finished the ice cream. Now we're going to the next station. Oh, this is a cool place. Wow, this is a very interesting place. Beer, clocks, typewriters, accordions, and old cameras. All right, guys, 
It has been a pleasure meeting you both. <laughs> you seem like you know me already, but I'm meeting you guys for the yeah. first time. <laughs> I'm red. I've been in the sun too much. <laughs> it's always nice to meet some, uh, some subscribers. I hope that I will meet more of you. If you guys are in Korea, anywhere, I know a few of you are in Busan. I'm looking forward to meeting you. Uh, you have to buy the beer though. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to end the vlog because I need to ride home, it's dark and late. Uh, so like, subscribe, share, comment, and... Jayo. Jayo.